So again, John wrote his gospel so that we can come to faith in Jesus Christ and through that faith have life. This week, we have a great opportunity for our parish mission. Dr. Carol Raza, she's a psychologist. She teaches at the seminary. She was one of my professors, but she's also a worldwide preacher of the gospel of how to live life in the spirit. What does that look like? She's traveled the whole world, preached to thousands and thousands of people, helping them to come alive in the spirit. So she'll be with us Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday night at 7 o'clock. Wednesday, we'll start with Mass, as we normally do at 7, and then she'll give us a talk about what, what are those wounds, what are those walls, those doors that we're hiding behind, what are the lies that we are swimming in that prevent us from living a life fully alive. On Thursday at 7, we'll begin with a, a period of prayer and praise, and then she'll talk to us about what does God's Word say as the antidote to the lies of the world. Where are the promises found in sacred scripture to help awaken the Holy Spirit? And on Friday night, again, we'll begin at 7, prayer, praise, and then she'll talk to us about what does life in the Spirit look like. It's an opportunity to really transform your life and your family and our parish and our community. I really am praying that each one of us takes time to come. Maybe you can't come to all three nights, but please try to come and encounter This amazing woman who's dedicated her life to the formation of priests and the changing of lives by living in the power of the Holy Spirit. So again, it's Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday at 7 p.m. here in the church. And also for anyone who works in the medical field, doctors, nurses, therapists, whatever, healthcare, at 5 p.m. on Friday, she wants to meet with you to help you know what it means to live a life in the Spirit in your healthcare field so that you can bring that healing power that we heard about in the gospel and that we hear about in the first reading to your patients, to your, your clinic, whomever you're serving. She wants to spend time with you, to pray with you, to encourage you, to equip you for this beautiful, wonderful work that you do. That's Friday at 5 o'clock here in the church. So let's pray for our parish this week that we, to, we truly do come alive in the Spirit.